That's my favorite one. That's my favorite one. That's, that's my favorite one. Yeah, that's, oh. that's the sriracha maple juice. Have you, double, have you tripled up these burgers from normal burgers? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. So you got, you got three, three beef in there. Uh, it's like triple what we normally put in. Then you've got like an extra bit of chicken in each of these. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Yeah. So glad I trained. How, what do you reckon in terms of calories? Uh, four. Probably like around five. Probably five each. Sweet. Five. What's up guys? Um, a lot of people have asked for this on my YouTube channel, so we have delivered. I've reluctantly recruited Luke Zocchi. He's a weapon though, he can eat. Um, basically, rocked on down to Main Street Burger in Byron Bay. Uh, I don't want to call this a challenge as such, just because you know I'm swimming sort of 15 kilometers, 20 kilometers with a strength session and running. You're doing quite a lot, aren't you, Zocchi? Oh, I actually haven't trained today, but I've been to <laughs> <laughs> and I just had a late lunch, so I can't wait for this. So I don't want to necessarily call it a challenge because um, sometimes it's hard to make up these sorts of calories uh, cleanly. You know, so if I was trying to make up 10,000 calories just in broccoli um, and salads and stuff like that, I would just be grazing all day. So I will do another video where I talk about everything that I'm, I'm actually eating today, from you know, uh, porridge oats, vegetables, looking at uh, micronutrients, vitamins, minerals. However, today. It's not about that. We have a big swim tomorrow, so this is just about getting the calories in. Luke Zocchi has jumped in with me. Talk me through it. What are you going to attack first? I thought I was going to do my Oreo with a bit of cream. I think I'm going to go with the that's chick... the worst thing to start on that. <laughs> Why? I'm not a competitive eater, but that seems like suicide. <laughs> oh, okay, maybe I won't do that though. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm going to start with the chicken. I just don't know how physically... Do you have to squash it down? It looks so nice. I don't want to ruin this burger, but I'm going to have to. I'm not, I, uh, I'm not entirely sure. I think you're right. I think chicken burger. And then this seems to just be, I love how it's like just a little bit of a bonus. <laughs> how we've got the, the onion rings as well. Can I just yeah. add something? Jack told me he had to go get chopsticks because these burgers are so high that this is a chopstick. <laughs> I, I love that. So in between as well, we'll start, we'll make a start. Take a little bit of a break and we'll talk about diet and nutrition and I can quiz you about your diet and nutrition, your book and, awesome. and, and everything else. So let's get involved <laughs> and we will talk in a little bit. How are you going to eat that too? I don't... <laughs> <laughs> have you moved? Have you moved the chopstick? Oh, that is amazing. Do you think we go slow or fast? That is good. That is good. Isn't that good? good. Alright. If you have it, and I don't like to use the term cheat meal, but if you're gonna like properly chow down, what's your meal of choice? Are you sweet or are you savory? Uh, I'm a bit of a fan of pizza. Mm. And I like burgers too, like. I don't think I've ever eaten as many burgers until I met you. You could be a competitive eater. No, no way. Right. Don't you give in. Don't you give in. You're going to be a gym shark <laughs> sponsored competitive eater. <laughs> You've got flexible clothes around the midsection. How much did you reckon that is in meat? Will that be a kilo of meat there? Uh, 500 grams. 
500 pounds. <laughs> that's, a, that's a tiny chicken. How have I got it on my elbow? Mm. I mean, I've seen you eat more than that. You reckon? There's good studies showing that endurance athletes need to train their digestive system and they can learn a lot from competitive eaters. Wow. So I think on like long swims and mind stuff, when people say, how do you eat and then go and swim? I'm like, that's all I do. So what you're doing now is training your digestive system. You're, you're becoming a better endurance athlete. I'm not an endurance athlete. <laughs> <laughs> well, the milkshake's amazing. I think it's the fact of just looking at it as well. It is so big. Oh, that is good. Oh no, I'll put it on my hat. <laughs> That's cheap. He's hiding it under his hat. I knew it. Yes. Oh, I'm not like I'm not a competitive eater at all, but I did a long swim, you know. So I think like the competitive eaters would smash this. Me and Zoki are keen amateurs. You got more. You got more than that. I haven't trained today. I've literally gone for a surf. I had a late lunch at like two o'clock. Seven now. Second meal of the day. Come on, Luke. I think you'll do that. Did That's they? not a lot. You just have to pace yourself. It's not a lot. Tell you what you got to do. We need to just got to adapt to the situation. Oh. Don't give up. Don't give up. Just de deconstruct it. Reverse engineer, deconstruct <laughs> it. How do you get from A to B? No. I don't think I can do it. Yeah, the Oreo. Oh, that is good. <laughs> One thing I always find is you always have like a pudding stomach. It doesn't matter how much you've eaten. If someone comes out and goes, do you want dessert? You go, Yes, yes I do. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 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 I don't know if I'm here. I reckon I'm going to see you finish that part off, Ross. No way! That is your Everest. Your half Nord burger. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. But it's less of a you nibbled yeah. under the bottom. <laughs> I'm trying to think what we should train tomorrow now based on the fact we are half up. Everything. What? Swim in the morning, powerlifting session, midday. And then the hill or something. Oh, my God. Could you imagine hill sprints? Oh. Guys, like I said, it wasn't necessarily an eating challenge. It was just two guys hanging out and eating a lot of calories because we're, we're training a lot tomorrow. But Zoki provided more comedy value than I was eating. I always need the help. I always need the help. <laughs> Because if you like the video, make sure you subscribe and also leave some comments on what you want Zoki to eat next time. <laughs> um, a huge shout out as well to Main Street Burger. We, we are actually talking about doing another eating competition here. I don't think it's going to be meat based. Oh yeah. I well, because you're not feeling any more meat, are you? There's something... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on right now. I just need some time for myself. <laughs> <laughs> think about what I've done. Zonky's tapping out. Uh, we'll see you next time for another, not eating challenge, too many eating. Too many eating, I like that. <laughs> uh, okay guys, uh, as I said, that wasn't necessarily an eating challenge. Just two guys, just hanging out in the corner of Main Street, just eating a lot of calories because we're swimming and training so much. That's what it was. But, if you liked it, make sure you subscribe, like this video, and also as well, comment below. I'm gonna, he doesn't know it yet, but I'm gonna rope Zoki into another few eating challenges. So, list below what you wanna see, whether it's sweet, savory, breakfast, lunch, just let us know in the comments below. Um, I'm gonna tuck into this. I think Zoki has seen better days. <laughs>